the lovely voice of God, your tender voice revealing the mysteries of your Hey, Thomas! Ah, what? I told you, what's wrong with you? Ah, you're supposed to wait for me after class. Is it compulsory? Ah, ah. Oh, why are you wearing a long I'm, face? I'm, I'm, the good mood. Oh, what's wrong with you? I've had this Cindy girl on my mind the whole day. You and this your Cindy, Cindy girl. I mean, what is wrong? I mean, talking about Cindy, talking about Cindy. When are you going to propose to that beautiful girl? Eh? When? Do you think it's about proposal? Eh? If, it, if it's about proposing to her, I can go right now and go and propose. It's not uh -huh. about that. See, anytime a thought comes that I should go and propose to her, then I feel this kind of burden. I don't feel a peace within me. See, any time I think about it, then my systolic pressure rises. <laughs> it's, it's, it's as if I'm going to take a penalty for Ghana. Then my heart starts beating. Wait, oh. wait, wait, Thomas, take it, take it easy. This one, your pressure is rising. Don't die on me. Hey, hey, I mean, that. but come to think of it, for a girl that loves you, why should it be a problem for you to propose to her? I don't get you, Thomas. You that your understanding is slow or what? I'm saying that, eh? Like any time I, I think about it that I'm going to propose, uh -huh. then I don't feel peace in you. I even had a dream. I had a dream about her some time ago. And it didn't end. It's like when I enter that relationship, it's no way. But once she's beautiful, that must work. That's my... <laughs> uh, Thomas, see, all these stories you are telling me, I honestly think that you're running out of gas. I mean, why is it that at this time of year, you're complaining about proposing Thomas, to a girl? Thomas, I've been calling you. Your number is not going to. Please, we have to go. Yeah, we have to go for our church after that. We we'll go for visitation. Please, let's go. It's time. Uh, Shabi, I need to get some food from the roadside. I'll, I'll see Tomorrow you. we'll go to church. I'll come yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll see you. Thomas, so you will talk. You talk. I'll see you. I'll see Thomas, if I don't want to go for the What is it? I have the Cindy girl I told you about. <laughs> yeah. You know, I've been telling you about everything in my life. Mm. I told you that. Mm -hmm. But any time I think of proposing to her, then my heart starts beating. Eh. Why will you have to... See, listen, come, come, Thomas. Why are you thinking so much? You have to be led by the Spirit of God. You have to let the Holy Spirit lead you in a major decision like this. Why will you just not pray about it and ask God to help you? Eh? I pray, but the, the response I have is that it's like it will not work. But you see, it, it's beautiful. And that's the standard. It will work. No, 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 no. You can't be talking like that, Thomas. No. How can you think like that? Oh, eh? When you start to preach on the Holy Spirit on Sunday, you have to download that message and soak it in. You will receive direction. The Holy Spirit is going to lead you into all truth. He's going to teach you. He's going to guide you. He's going to show you things concerning your future. Thomas, it looks like you are very confused. You need intimate counseling. Tomorrow, when we go to church, I'm taking you to that place. You're you are going to have counseling. I, I mean, I, I thought counseling was for people who are new members hey. and they just came. Me, I've been no, around no, for no, some no, time. No, 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 the counseling is not for new, uh, new members. You also need counseling. Oh, Don't you know you need counseling? Uh, uh, me. Thomas. I'll go, you, I'll go. Even the laptop is so nice. See her pictures. <laughs> wow. <sighs> so I've got a new laptop like this. <sighs> should I propose? Hey, see the pictures. They're so nice. Hello, Cindy. Hey, Hello, Cindy. Thomas. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> You're not even giving me a hug. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I'm not asking for it to It's just that I'm oh. <laughs> I'm giving it to you now. <laughs> hey, is, is that your new laptop? Yes. So, you know, it's not hard for me. You know, I don't struggle to get gadgets like this. <laughs> I, rec I receive it. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> so, you know, anytime I see you, I'm, I'm very happy. That's, I, that's what I wanted to tell you. You see, sometimes your beauty baffles me. Do you get it? I, I don't think there's any camera good enough to capture your real beauty. You see, I, I'm sure eh, that you are pretty beyond megapixels. <laughs> <laughs> Just the way you're watching me now in 3D. <laughs> hey, Cindy. 
<laughs> so how, how have you been? How have you been? Oh, I've been fine. But see the way you're asking me how I'm doing. I see if you came to see me the other day. I asked you to come. Oh, I, I came. I came. Just that your roommate told me you were not around. Yes, I came. I, I me? Came. You came to my room and you didn't see me? Uh, yes, I came. You were not there. Unless you were in the locker. I entered the room. You were not there. Uh, Okay, I remember. I was in the study room. Oh, you know I can study a lot, fashion things and all that. Ah, wait, too. you were in the study room? Yes. Your roommate said that you went to watch movies with your friends. Or they study in the cinema now, so that I can also go there and study. Oh, wait, wait. Thomas, did you look at me, Cindy, from head to toe? And you told me that I'm lying. No, right now you just called me a oh. liar. I, I never mentioned yes, the word. Yes, you told me a lie right now. It's just that what you are saying is contradicting what your roommate said. That, okay, you were studying. You were studying. <laughs> now you come. Yes, you were studying. Oh, <laughs> why? But, but by the way, who told you that I wasn't around? Your roommate, uh, Dinah. The, the <gasps> short one. That Dinah girl again. Every time she's always on my neck, what I would do to her? Slam around there. What, what I would do to that Dinah girl? Oh, don't. Even like that. That's why I don't. I, I didn't want to tell you the name. You go and quarrel with her. You be yelling. A nice girl like you, you shouldn't be shouting, quarrelling, arguing. Eh? You are from a good Christian home, eh? and, and your parents raised you up in the Lord, and you found yourself in a good church too. So allow yourself to be worked on by the Holy Spirit. Mm. Huh. Don't, don't be doing that. Your parents raised you up in the Lord. Why? I know. I know. Huh. Cindy. We, do you Cindy. see? Even the other time, she she got me upset. And she's lucky. If you were to be when I was in my house, Cindy, she would have received 12 fools of what Cindy, I gave to her. She's lucky that I've changed. Hi. Hello. Cindy, please, I need my laptop. I have an eye tomorrow. I need to start you. What? Your laptop? Where? Uh, Rose told me you came from my laptop yesterday. Have you ever seen me in your room before? What's all this? Eh? Ah. Just give me the laptop. I, I really, I have an eye. I don't I have your laptop. Learn. What's all this? Why are you accusing me? What did I do? You, you don't have my laptop. I don't have your laptop. Ah, so go. was Rose lying to me or what? Yes, maybe. I don't know. Uh, well, you have a new laptop, right? You have a new laptop. The one I saw you using just now. It, it's, oh, it's not for you. Hi. Please, are you sure your laptop is... Uh, she, my roommate told me she came for my laptop. Oh, no, she got a laptop new, no, she got a new laptop. That's why I'm... No. I'm like, she got a new laptop. Hey! Oh, why? Cindy! It's not your laptop. Is, it the, is your name written on it? It's not my is laptop. laptop. Wait. It's, it's not my laptop. Yes. So, the black mark here, who is it for? How do oh, you know you that oh, Hey, keep hey, quiet. Ah. Beautiful girl like this, you've been stealing. It's okay. If it's yours, then take it. Indeed, beautiful. Please. Beautiful. It's vain. Look ah. at you, beautiful girl. Thief like you. you I'm very, very ashamed of you. Why? Like hey, hey, hey. Why? Cindy. Hey, so the laptop is not for you. Why are you trying to say it's yours? Anytime I'm talking to you, one lie will appear by all means. It's like that one is uh, uh, your trademark. It will come. Why? I, I'm beginning to. Be, I, I don't know whether all the things you have been telling me is true. Why are you making it hard for me to, to, to choose you? Why? Why are you making it hard for me? You are always lying. See, eh? get, get the simple truth. I don't even know how the laptop came here. I have not even gone to her house. Eh? Uh, why are you also accusing me? You accusing me in front of her, and now you're accusing me. What did I do? I'm not accusing you. I'm not accusing you. See, ah. I, I'm getting tired of this whole thing. I'm trying to impress you. I, I join you to church. I even speak in tongues. I even follow you for Basenta ministries. I follow you for outreach. I, I'm oh, tired of all this. Down, I cannot do down. it again. Oh, Leave come me alone. Oh, please calm down. Hey! 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 Where's hey. my week? Where's my week? What, what is this? Hey! Deceptions. Hey! No, this is exactly what the prophet said. Some of these girls are full of deceptions. I'll tell my shepherd about it. Hey, Shepi. Yay. Oh, God. Hey. <laughs> Shepi. Shepi. You, you can't believe it. No, no, relax, relax. Tell me what happened. Cindy. Hey? No, right now, I'm not sure whether she's called Cindy or not. I, I, I'm, I'm, now, I don't know what to even think again. I think God has saved me. What, what happened? I, I went to see her. I went to visit her. And we were quarreling over a laptop. That one, I don't want to go into it. And she was feeling that she's angry. I, I just wanted to bring her back. Mm -hmm. 
Then what I brought back was a hair. Hey. Hey, hey, Are you that, serious? I'm telling you, and I saw her real head. Hey. Like a cashew nut. I, I, I'm telling you. Hey, Shapi. Oh, wow. See, I, I remember the time you told me to go and listen to the, the preaching again. Uh -huh. It was as if I was not in the service that day. Wow. That is when I realized that the prophet was saying that in, in, John, in John chapter 14, 26, that yeah, the Holy Spirit exactly. would teach us all things and bring to our remembrance. And you see that the prophet said that repetitions is a sign that the Holy Spirit wow. is talking to you. So all this time I was not feeling peace within my heart mm. and it was coming in the dream the and Holy all Spirit that. was speaking to you. Hey! I told you, see, the prophet said that the Holy Spirit will remind you. He will be your teacher. He will, he will show you things to come. He's the spirit of truth. He's going to guide you. Okay. See, make the Holy Spirit your best friend. He's your counselor. He's your teacher. He's your everything. In talking about counseling, eh, the intimate counseling to confirm it. Because when wow. I told the pastor about it, he said, once I'm not feeling peace and it's coming, it's coming, but I should just relax and not go and propose. Wow. So I was okay with it and... Now the Holy Spirit showed me this. You see. I, I'm so thankful for the prophet. Wow. Hey, and I said message. when I was listening to it, it's as if I was not in the wow. service that day. It's very important. For me, the Holy Spirit is my best friend. I don't know about you. He's going to lead you and he's going to guide you. And you have a supernatural life. Thanks for watching. We'll bring you more next week. It's the sweetest sound my heart has ever heard. The lovely voice of God